Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to Forza Motorsport 4. Today is episode number 22. If you guys are enjoying the content, then be sure to leave a like, comment down below, subscribe, and feel free to hit that join button as it really does help support the channel. Hopefully you guys enjoy. This episode was streamed live on YouTube. If you want to make sure to catch the streams, then be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. If you want to get cheap game keys for Xbox, PlayStation, or PC, then check out Eniba in the description down below. All left. I keep saying all right, so I, w I wanna I wanna say something a little different. Uh, we're starting with the uh the wagon body style event, but the wag gone open. A celebration of the family sports wag gone. Why is there two G's for those, but one G for the other one? Confusion. Confuzzled. <laughs> But fuck it, we'll go with it. Uh, so we're taking an Audi. <laughs> My favourite mechanic is Bob the Builder. What the fuck? <laughs> That's brilliant. So we start off with Silverstone, Hockenheim Ring, Iberian Circuit, Nürburgring, and then the Burmese Alps. Alright, here we go. We got the RS2. Oh, it's hide oh, it looks hideous from the back. I hate it when cars look shit from the back. Whoa! What even in the flying fuck was that? Not even gonna question it. This is four wheel drive though, so this has got some some performance to it. How much is your merch? Uh, it's it's gone up in price thanks to uh, Teespring deciding to make it more expensive. It was uh, like thirty nine ninety nine. It's now up to forty nine ninety nine. So that's uh, wow. That's the price for the hoodie. If you want, like, we got phone cases and all sorts of different shit. Um, there's a new hoodie coming out. Hopefully in about a week. Uh, depending on how long it takes for me to finish off this design. But uh, I've got a new hoodie coming out. It's quite cool, uh, tech-inspired design. And... Hopefully, before September, it should be ready to buy. What are you doing? Also, how how the fuck is that car a wagon? I've only just noticed it's a Subaru. It's a Subaru. Make a pink design so I can take it to Barbie. <laughs> I think there is a pink one actually. I don't even know. It's like, like, I I'm not hundred percent sure. I I could totally do a pink one. That would be funny as fuck. <laughs> A one with a car's engine exploding and call it Oppenheimer's car. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that would have been great merch to do when the films came out. That would have been... That would have been amazing, actually. Oppenheimer's car and... Uh, Barbie's... I don't know. Barbie's house. Something like that. That doesn't work quite well. But... Now nah, that actually would have been quite funny. Beep, beep, bitch, get out of the way. Ah! Gran Turismo. New. Gran Turismo actually, uh, uh, it was a very good film. No, 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 no. <laughs> I know you're trolling. <laughs> oh. No worries. See you later. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. Do 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 do.
Do, 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 do. That's uh, race number one done. I'll, I'll take it. Level 38, modern GT2. Yeah, we're definitely not getting the Bugatti. That definitely wasn't a free car. Why did I think it was in this game for free as well? Ah, oh, this is where you get the art car. Obviously going to pick the art car. Why wouldn't I? Mate, that BMW arc... Oh, it's so beautiful. Look how good that looks. That looks so good. I love it. I love it. I love it. Hamburger cheeseburger Big Mac Whopper. Let's go. Race number two. Two of five. I think it's five of them. This Audi is cool. Quick, but look at those Subarus go. Oh my... What even the... F f what? Okay. <laughs> Do you know what turn one is famous for? Parking your car on the inside of the corner. Do you know what? Let me... Do you know what I'm going to do today? I'm going to park my car on the apex. Please. Please. Move, move aside. Move aside so I can park. Right here, on this spot of land called the Apex. What even the... Ah. Oh. Irritation 100. There's going to be a lot of Skyrim and Fallout memes. <laughs> when Starfield comes out, I'm going to be saying a lot of those memes. Everybody liked that. Yay! bad so far. This is actually quite an enjoyable race. I do like the structure that this game actually takes. Just because of the fact in later... In, in Motorsport 3, once we got to the later events, it was just lots of like 15 minute races. Just 15 minutes, 15 minutes, 15 minutes. And it got really boring really quick because it was just so like so much for so little at the end whereas this is sort of ah here's some short ones then a bit longer then a bit longer then really long then short again then a bit longer doing it in i very much prefer how they structured the races in this game all right all right all right all right all right here we go Come on, squeeze it through. That's what she said. That's not what she said. When is Photocop starting? Uh, it's already started in uh, AGC. Which actually reminds me, I need to get the link of AGC put in my description. But yeah, it should be uh, available to join. Um, I'll send you the link to the website. Or if you put um, autogc.xyz into your web browser. You'll also get sent straight there. You can join the Discord via that link. The website isn't technically fully public yet, so it's it, it's not ready. Um, the website should be sorted fully by the end of August. But it's it's all available that anyone can join it now. It is a public community. Can you send me the link? I literally told you the link. I literally said it. Auto. 
GC dot XYZ. <laughs> That's the website. All you gotta do is type that in. Your web browser will do the rest. And uh, if it doesn't, then you have a stupid web browser. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. Um, boom. Boom. Boom, 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 Shoulder to shoulder. Doesn't work. Did you spell it right? Auto, as in the word that's on the screen now. A-U-T-0. A-U-T-O. Why did I say zero? <laughs> I know the website was definitely working yesterday, so... What do you mean? It, I literally just typed in auto gc dot xyz. It definitely works. I'm on it right now. Car's got some power. I think there's something wrong with my keyboard. It keeps sort of flickering and doing some weird shit. Not my great time. Whoa, 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 the Super Woo's died! The Super Woo! No! Oh, this thing pulls. Like, it, it rips. No IRL. No IRL. Has to be from a video game for the, the competition. But uh, the competition doesn't start until uh, September anyways, so. It's like the, the upload phase now, and then the voting phase goes from the start of September to the end of September. While from the start of September to the end of September, you can upload for October and so on and so on. See, the one thing, um, obviously we was talking about sort of streaming, how to make it full time for me and whatnot. I have done the maths, I have done the numbers, 
And I need... But, uh, realistically speaking, I need to be earning two grand a month. To be able to pull it off and be able to say, right, I can easily and comfortably just live off of streaming. Fun. So it's not happening anytime soon, unfortunately. How sad. We got one more race after this one. And then we is done. Two K pounds. So I need to get two thousand pounds a month to be able to go full time. Which uh, realist uh, two thousand pounds is anywhere from about a hundred thousand views, which obviously isn't easy to do. And that's just pure ad revenue. But if ad revenue is about ten percent of what I'm earning, obviously we need channel memberships and whatnot. So. Realistically speaking, if everyone that was subscribed right now joined as a channel member on the cheapest tier, I could go full time. Which isn't a lot. The cheapest tier is 99 pence. That's 12 pounds in a whole year. And I could quite easily fully retire. Just like that. Like, I could, well, not retire, but like, I could go full time as a content creator and continue from there, grow, and then retire at like 40, something like that. The numbers make sense, but it needs to sort of happen, if that makes sense, as well. Obviously, growing isn't happening anytime soon, but I mean, I'm not fussed. I'm enjoying doing streaming and whatnot, but obviously, like, life is a thing as well. A, a lot of people that watch content creators will go around and say, like, oh, but you're thinking about money? Is that all you think about? Like, you must be mi- Like... Yeah, for- for content creators like Mr. Beast to- uh, He's minted. He doesn't have to worry about money. But he doesn't make his videos about like, Oh, I need this money, I need that money, or whatnot. When a streamer who has less views says about money, it normally means because they need the money to pay rent. To pay bills. And then beyond that, maybe be able to put invest some money into the stream that they earn. Like, right now, on average, I'm earning like 1.2k a month from work. Right, and I'm struggling to get to the end of the month whilst also investing not too much into YouTube at the moment. I'm not really investing much into it. I'm not investing much into the streaming side of stuff. I'm not investing much in any of it, really, realistically speaking. But I'm still struggling. Obviously, it's it's quite a touchy subject. Talking about money for anyone, it's t like I'm not too fussed. Like I know I'm not rich. I know I'm not. You know, minted, or whatnot. But that's why I'm, I'm comfortable saying like I'm broke. I know I'm broke. So what? Deal with it. It only affects me. But yeah, it w it would be awesome. Like if I could get. Enough that I could go. Like, at, at the moment it's part time. It's just I'm doing it because I feel like I want to just kill some time, play some video games, chat with chat. But eventually there will be a point where, or hopefully there'll be a point where I can grow and obviously there'll be more people. 
And if it keeps growing, that point could happen. Where you sort of question, oh, actually, can I do this full time or not? Is it realistic to be able to do this full time? Can I do it full time? I'd love to do it full time, but. And obviously, the, all those questions will happen. Any content creator you see nowadays that has gone from, you know, part time content creation to quitting their job has had all those discussions, all those debates and whatnot before coming to the decision, I've finally quit my job and I'm doing YouTube full time. So, you know, I don't think it's going to be anytime soon. I doubt it's going to be anytime within the next five years, in all honesty, but I'm thoroughly enjoying what I'm doing and I got no complaints. And that's all that matters. Woohoo! Oh yeah, it's deep, but it's true. And unfortunately, a lot of people don't realize that. Like, they don't look deep into stuff. So they just assume and make assumptions. And that's not how shit works, unfortunately. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.